Yeah, it's, it's, it's all involuntary. The speaking and the words, it's like there's no choice involved in the words. So it's just like a, an expression or a delivery. And even that's part of a prearranged plan. You know, it's the, the script is written, the words are written, the metaphors, the examples, and yet awareness, when, when you're it just in the, the glee, the joy, the happiness, it's, it's, not, it's not linked or dependent on, on the words. So it's not really a, a benefit for this person or that person or whatever. It's just it's like a, a showering of what's beneficial for the whole. And the words are just given, but it, it's only the ego that would try to infer something or deduce something like a Sherlock Holmes or conclude something from the words. But the words are coming from a a state they're just kind of emanating from from a state and there was a time when I seemed to have an aspect that would judge the words that would come out and I think we've all gone through those things where we're just like observing and aware and and somehow judging the words what does that mean and what's this and you know but then at some point that ceases so there's not there's not an inner judge or an inner critic, a separate aspect that's keeping score and, well, that was good. No, I shouldn't have said that. You know, all that part, like Tinkerbell, it <laughs> goes away. Yeah. The words can come out in ways that are used in helpful ways. I can feel the helpfulness, but I don't. I can't pick apart the, the meaning of the words anymore. Somebody one time called me the talking mystic. I think it was Kirsten, she said, you're the talking mystic. So many words, so many words. And I said, hey, isn't that funny that the, the character of David was so shy and got voted most quiet and just again the Holy Spirit uses whatever. It can be kind of striking, There's, there wasn't anything back in the personality self that would have given a clue to the to the use. Which is good to know that it, we don't have to hold ourselves to the past of what we think we're capable of or not. The Holy Spirit's like, yeah, yeah, well, I say you're ready, <laughs> and here we go. <laughs> and, okay, then oh, let's be about it. <laughs>